Hey yo, it's TYYT, back again with another Tokyo Ghoul review. I want to kind of make this short like the other Tokyo Ghoul reviews, but I'm also going to be putting episode 22 and 23 in this same video because I did not review 22 last week. So I'm going to put all of it in one video. So with 22, 22 opens with Kaneki and Rize having a talk in wherever they are, I guess in his mind or whatever. And the talk wasn't bad. It just... Like the rest of Tokyo Ghoul, it just seemed, you know, kind of boring. No, I don't want to say completely boring because I did enjoy that part. But it's just like when he talks, when Kaneki talks and have these like real deep, I don't, I don't know how to explain it, but whereas like it, it brings you to think almost. But it just, it doesn't fit because how the show is gone. I don't know, it just doesn't, it kind of makes it like a big contradiction in a way. Hey, hey, there was a plus though. Rize was a, <laughs> Rize was looking thick. I ain't gonna lie, boy. The animators was in they duffel with that one. But, you know, and then we, I'm gonna fast forward through the most shit and now I'm gonna get to the humans turning into ghouls. Uh, that's kind of a plot twist that I wasn't expecting. I guess I guess the little glob things they explode and then they infect or boost your RC cells and turn humans into ghouls. So now I guess all the humans have a possibility of turning into ghouls. Um so there's that. This nigga Kaneki looked different again. He got like the hair, it looked like he got longer hair now. He got shit under his eye. I don't know what the fuck is up with him. He got a transformation every goddamn episode, but um, so they got him out, and then he wanted to go outside for some reason. I mean, I I didn't really make no sense to me because you know whenever he goes outside, nothing good happens. And so he went outside. And then for it's the main protagonist of the story, you know, he pops up on the TV. He live. He getting lit. He doing interviews and shit. You know, he best news man in 2018. <laughs> but you know and then they get attacked uh psycho gets shit she one of them blow up in her face even though they just watched a video of it happening she attacks one of them and it blows up it didn't make no damn sense but you know she was talking about oh leave me bullshit bullshit and then Kaneki bust out his new sparkling power ranger i don't even know what to call it that nigga just pulled out the whole Rainbow sparkly glittered cogany. I don't know what the fuck that was. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much all I wanted to talk about for the episode 22. Ain't much happened. Same with episode 23. Um, I mean, a lot shit, a lot of shit happened in episode 23, but I just feel like it was just so underwhelming. It it wasn't good. It was just so underwhelming. I mean, the music was great. The piano in the background, that shit was fly. Um, but everything else, like the Renji, which if you don't know, that's Yomo, and the Utah fight, that shit didn't make no sense to me. I'm not even gonna flex. Um, the redhead bitch just stood there and watched. Then you had Amon versus Don Dontero, Dontero, or whatever his name is, the old priest name, with the clown dude. Um, that just, oh man, this shit is bad. So they all have fights going on, and then they have the owl, which I'm guessing is Eto with her head off. I don't know. I think I screenshotted it, so I'll put it up there for you guys to look at. But yeah, there was that. So, and then there was an emotional scene with Amon and Don Taro after he, Amon sliced him in half, pretty much killing him. I just didn't feel it. It, just, <laughs> it was a lot of forced emotion. But that's what happens when you rush a show. And then the quality isn't that good. And the fights aren't that good in the arts. But, hey, you know. But I'm not going to talk about... Oh, well, the final episode is next week. So I'll probably make a longer video, like, reviewing that episode. And then reviewing Tokyo Gori as a whole. So be on the lookout for that. But other than that, you know, nothing really impressive about these last two episodes. 
which is expected by now. But I'm not gonna hold y'all. If you like the video, subscribe, of course. Tell me what you thought about the recent episodes in the comment section. Tell me what you thought about the video in the comment section. Um, if you do subscribe, turn post notifications on so you know whenever I post. And yeah, man, I'm out.